right, well, let's see what uh, Casey and Brandon think about that. They're celebrating National Avocado Day. Yeah, they are. <laughs> with the San Diego Food Bank on the Guac Off competition. Yes. How's it going, guys? You guys finish it? Okay. We finish. Take a look at the final product. Ooh. What do you think? Ooh, I like you the presentation. Hear the, the presentation is wonderful. Beautiful. That's right. You eat with your eyes before yes. you eat with your mouth there, Jason. That's what we always say. <laughs> this is a beautiful presentation. We have a wonderful guacamole here, heavily with the lime and heavy with the cilantro. We also had to add on top a little of that cotija style, that cheese, a little chicharrone blend and a little onion just for show to make you feel happy. And then we have some um, chili pepper chips just to add a little bit on top. Because what we really care about is getting the whole essence of the guacamole when we're here. So we'll see, maybe I could judge next. Hey, come judge us next. <laughs> <laughs> so the judges are walking through each booth right now. So I believe we're gonna be after this Whichever guy station that over is. there. But it just, it looks, Everything looks good. What does he have going on? It's pretty good. Zafron is liquid gold, ladies and gentlemen. Liquid gold. I think we have some liquid gold. Brandon, what would you say our spice level on our guacamole is? You know, it could have been hotter, but the problem is I like to keep um, guacamole and basically all substances hot, so it's hard for me to downgrade that to someone else's level because I don't know what I'm supposed to be approaching. You don't want to have somebody eating and say they start coughing and stuff. Anyway, hey, Kevin, I'm going to... This is 91X, I'm gonna try theirs. I didn't invite me to try it. It looks very, um, it's great, great color. I wish we could have that kind of color. He had a lot going on over here. I think he even put pineapples in it. I'm gonna try it too. You can taste the pineapple, that's for sure. Let's try this. Let's see. We have some friendly competition mm -hmm. over here. Oh, good. I'm glad because I'm not competing against you guys. You're glad you're not competing against us? We, we, we can be, we can be equal because we're Ooh, good. We I like fired. the touch of the pineapple in there. Yeah, it didn't hurt. It didn't That's hurt. good. It doesn't hurt at all. You know what? I tried ours and it's better. Oh! <laughs> just talking that mess. Did you grow these too? Yeah. Did you grow these too? I grew everything here. You the grew the coriander seed, the pineapple, the peppers, mm -hmm. the chips. I got mine, I got all my stuff from a local garden. It's the Vaughn's Garden. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Anyway, all of our people are getting ready to come up now. We're going to get the, uh, we're going to be graded, hopefully. And then you can see live what they thought of us. And you know what? We should point out, the first round, we are going against 107 Big FM. So this is, yes. the, Big this is our competition over here for the first round. And Big FM made a big mistake. Let's do it. Oh, we're getting judged now. Got to go. All right. Hello, How much everyone. Time do we have, Andre? Hello, do we have judges. Time to watch all this? It's great to see all of you today, and thank you, thank you very much for being a part of all of this. And we are honored here at KUSI to also be a part of this. Let us present to you now our take here in the first round of this guacamole challenge. Um, we did our basic blend of the guacamole, got some wonderful lime accents on the cilantro was heated, everything nicely blended and mushed in, and then we decided to top it with some of that nice crumbling cheese, and then to be a little special, went with the chicharron on top, a little blend, a little bit stuck in. So if you don't want to have it with the chip, go ahead and have it with the cheech. And then we also chili peppered up. We chili peppered up the uh, chips for you as well. So please, dig in and enjoy. Because here we have guacamole every hour, every day. The USI can do it with the That's what I know. This looks fantastic. Ooh, we got a reaction. That's good. We got a reaction. Y'all see that? Y'all see the reaction? Mm -hmm. Y'all see that stuff? The, the, the way that all works together adds all that saltiness. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta be gentle with the chips. That is some industrial guacamole. We don't do things light around here. <laughs> too strong. Too strong. Too powerful. The avocados are from Peru. That's right. Yeah. The, they're, they're stronger than Machu Picchu. Is that a good face? These avocados. Your eyes are very wide. This man approves. Was, you approve. Mm -hmm. See this. See how he went in. See how he went in with that. He got. The the idea. You got the idea. Okay. What do you get? The chicharrones? Chicharrones, yes. Yes. I think I have to go back for another. Ooh. She they're, went back for they're another. They're double dipping. We like it. That's what we like to see. Wow. Impressive. 
we've got to change it up a little bit. Get some new essence in here. That was our feeling. Interesting and good texture. Absolute. Well, thank you very much for coming, everybody. You know, Javier's who we have to look out for. You're quiet. He's very quiet. He's good. <laughs> Wow. Okay, Allie and Jason, I think we got some good reactions. I think you got Definitely. great reactions. Definitely. And Please everyone proceed. wants some of our guacamole. Yeah. Go uh -huh. for it. The word I, is out. I would say you got some excellent reactions. I think the chicharrones were a big hit, is what it's sounding like. Yep. So, all now right. we have to see what they think of our competition. Yeah. All right, we'll find out soon enough. We're going to keep an eye on it. Good job, you guys. Yeah. All right, the competition continues. Yes. I, hey, I think the reactions were really good. They're definitely in the running, um, that's for sure. Gosh, I'm, how do we get some of that delivered, Jason? Oops. Kevin, he's going to drive the van back. <laughs> I'm ready for it. Okay.